Roach. P. Roach! This one was requested by me. Oh, cool. Just me. <laughs> That's all. So shout out to all the patrons, yeah. Lindsay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I'm a lifelong Papa Roach fan, so. So we had to check this out. Yeah, why not? They're, they've been so good lately. They're just like, just a reliable band. They just have put out good music for like 20 plus years now, in my opinion, anyways. They just keep going. Nothing stops them. Jacoby Shaddix is just out there. He's doing features. He's popping up everywhere. They're keeping making music. Like, Dude. they've got so many original members too. I think it's like three out of four. If you guys didn't know about this, you're about to. Uh, the Who! It's The Who, isn't it? Oh yeah, it is! Yeah, that shit's so sick! Yeah! <laughs> it's- they're Mongolians or something? Yeah, dude! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the most badass Mongo- well, Mongolians in general are pretty badass. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this shit! Unbelievable. Those UFO drums? SAC? <laughs> so cool! Like throat singing or whatever that was? Yeah, kind of. What? I think, I think that's what you'd call it. Bro, I think they did two music videos for this song. Yeah, there's the original. Wait, yeah, Wolf Totem, look. You look, gotta, you gotta read this comment. Videos. What's the comment? <laughs> Jacoby has the aura of a dude who has no idea what he did to be invited or even quite what he's been invited to, but is super excited to be there nonetheless. That's the top comment, too, right? <laughs> so true, though. Yeah. Badass motherfucking <laughs> Mongolians on the track. The Who, Wolf Totem. They yeah. put out this song, it got 70 million views three years ago, and they re-released it with Jacoby Shaddix, and it got 25 million views. Unbelievable. They did two separate music videos for the song. <laughs> wow. So bad. Look at this fucking instrument. Like, I don't even know what it is. Me like, neither. <laughs> if so you know, cool. comment below. It looks like a two-string bass to me. Yeah. That he's playing with a freaking... Is he playing it with a... I thought he had like a bow. Yeah, one of the... Oh, yeah, no, look, he has do. a bow, dude. This guy too. That is so badass. So badass. Too now much you, hype. The more you know. I don't know if we can top that. I shouldn't have showed you guys till after. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure Cut the Line's gonna be sick. That's what we're checking out today for Lindsay. <laughs> Thank you. That's P. Roach's... <laughs> One of your OG favorites. One of my pathway bands into loving metal. Pathway band. You know how everybody has those like in between bands and then suddenly you listen to like Suicide Silence? Yo. There, but there's gotta be something in between. Yo, name your like, name your progression to Suicide Silence as fast as you can go. Oh, uh, Nickelback. All the 80s music my parents listened to, hair bands. It, Papa Roach, um, Bullet for My Valentine, Venge Sevenfold, Motionless and White. So it's getting a little heavier from there. Like it was. Watch, ready? Right? Mine was mine was Uraphus? Yeah. Right. yeah. Hit me, hit me. Oh, Trivium was in there. Billy Talent. Yeah. Disturbed. Yeah. Divine Heresy. And oh, Divine okay. Heresy is like as heavy as suicide, I would argue. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. Divine Heresy is like bead. If I could summarize that, it would be like Papa Roach, Bull of My Valentine, then heavy shit. Okay, true. Probably. Mine was like a long meandering journey with many, many bands. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Anyways. <laughs> Interesting. If you ever listen to On Par with Suicide Silence, mm -hmm. that sort of level, mm -hmm. which we all probably had a phase at one point, what were your band progression? Boom, boom, boom. Like, for me, it was such a jump. That's why I thought it was going to be for you, too. I really don't know Divine Heresy, though, honestly. So. Hang on a second. <laughs> Buckle in. Okay. Let's oh! Like, full Whitechapel vibes. Not quite. Yeah, I guess so. Is that Tommy Vex? <laughs> <laughs> is it? Look at those jean shorts though. Like, can we talk Wait, about those? Wait, is it Tommy? Those shorts? <laughs> no way, it's not, right? It's not. There's no way. You'd have to Google it probably. <laughs> oh my god, it's him! It he is! Got fired! Oh my gosh! It's actually Tommy. No way! I said in that last reaction video where we were checking out Tommy Vex's new song, I'd never really listened to him, and here he is. There he is! <laughs> and I was obsessed with this band. I dare say that a moment ago. I didn't even know it was the same guy. <laughs> That's actually crazy. Yeah, he did one record, and then they had a new guy for Divine Heresy Face Breaker. Now we've got like a David Draymond looking guy.
Way more melodic too, huh? Yeah, way more. Yeah, that was like disturbed and then this. Okay, cut the line. Well, let's get it. Yeah, let's hear it. Cut the line. Hold let's, the line. Let's do this. Hold, Hold the line. line. Yeah, Hold dude. the line. No, uh, cut the line. Today. Love grandson. Cut the line. Okay, yeah, back cut up. The line. Twinkle lights everywhere. Cause obviously. Love that. Some plants. Are you tangled up inside? Is it something that you hide? If you listen to the voice inside, c -c 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 cut the line. Cut the line. Are you trapped up in your thoughts? Tied up in knots, dying to find a way out. When there's nobody around and you're melting down, it seems like you need to reach out. Is this something that you want to say? 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 This is gnarly. His voice is so nostalgic for me. <laughs> My brother had that haircut at one point. <laughs> What? Okay, okay. My goodness. Jacoby's, Jacoby's parents' house. Um, oh, it was their old rehearsal? in that garage for the last 27 years. When, it, when is this going to stop? Yeah, I know. I'm sick of it. I, someday I wish I could park my car in there. Aww. What nice parents. Oh, wow. That is so wholesome. <laughs> That's so cute that they're wow. in the video. <laughs> the last 27 yeah. years. I've been there for 27 years. That's insane. That's as old as you. Hey. Sorry? I'm not there yet. He's got age outed. I'm not there yet. <laughs> Almost. Not till April. 
<laughs> okay, you're, you're right, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm making 26 last is all. <laughs> you're squeezing out every last little bit. Yes. My bad, my bad. We're jumping any conclusions. Oh, man. All right, what'd you think? That was, that was, this was for you. It was for me, I thought it was pretty good. I'm not like, oh my god, best song ever, but it was like, solid banger. Yeah, totally. Would listen again. My favorite part was the pre-chorus. I love dropping out to just that single kick, and then like, the chorus over top of it with like, the simple like, chuggy guitar. Mm -hmm. And then the chorus comes back through, and it's like, boom, in your face. I thought it was really cool that they did. I, I liked the rehearsal vibe the whole time, and then it was like, cherry on top when we found out that that was like, actually the spot where it all started. Yeah, that's actually amazing. That's pretty, that's pretty nuts. Yeah. I was thinking how much like, it reminded me of our house, with the twinkle lights, the Persian rug, the tap. Did you see what they had going on in the ceiling? That's what I'm trying to get done for the bedrooms. Can yeah, we do that? No, I just don't think it would look right in our space. I think it would work. I just, I don't I know. I disagree. Maybe. It looks cool in a garage. I just yeah. don't know if it would look good in like a... No, we'll do it. We'll make it work. <laughs> Once you get an idea, it's like, we're doomed. Not doomed. Get excited. <laughs> if it's an idea that I don't agree We are with. fortunate enough that yeah. I execute. Right? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyways. Very cool. But yeah, it, it's just like a, it's this band modernized, you know? I said earlier, I thought there was a lot of original members, but then I saw this video and that's clearly not the case. Drummer's been there for a long time. I don't know if he's, the, he's not the original one, actually. He's not, but he's been around for a long, long time. And the bassist obviously was not. <laughs> He's quite young. They're yeah. coming to Toronto. I think that drummer is Tony Palermo, but they had a guy before him. Yeah, they had this guy. Go up. See? See this uh, Tobin Esperance? Oh, no, no. David Buckner was f the first drummer. So. There it is right there. Okay, so how many members we've had? We've had quite a few. Only Jerry and Jacoby have been there the whole time. But look how long that second drummer's been around. Oh, no, it's a bassist. Huh. Oh, Tobin? Yeah. Oh, I'm saying that right. Tobin? Oh, my God. Tobin? I totally thought the bassist wasn't around for that long. No, no, no. Like, look, this okay. is this no. is half the career of this dude. You're right. I so this wrong. is like, this is solid. That's solid. Right? It's been the same four people since, what, like 2007-ish? Yeah, 2008. That's a long time. 2000, no, yeah. I was right. I thought I was wrong. Turns out I was pretty much right. The who? That was awesome. Sheesh. <laughs> Go check those guys out. What an experience, that, yeah. That track's nuts. Watch it from beginning to end. You gotta get all of it. Yeah, it's a good music video. <laughs> Strongly recommend. For sure. Although, go back. Uh, Papa Roach put out a song in the last maybe six months that was really, really dope. In the video, they were in sort of like a Dying to Believe, I think? Three, four months ago? That one was pretty bomb. Oh, this one. This one was sick. This is Swaco Fever 333. <laughs> You didn't see this? No, I don't remember this at all. Bro. This is amazing because you come back to the rap. It's perfect. Yeah, right? Look, Swaco driving. Ah. Okay. Yeah, it's That's too hype. fucking hilarious. Right? That was a great song, too. That's amazing. Wow. Premiered August 5th, 2021. Okay, nope. Totally missed that one somehow. Yeah. Wow. I had it requested a few times on, like, my live drum streams. I was oh. jamming over it. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah, yeah. That's really it's cool. It's a good song to jam over. Mm -hmm. It's just like basically a loop on the drums. So you can just have fun. Anyways, yeah, that's yeah. been it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for checking it out. We'll see you all very soon with something new.